Bowled him! What a ripper! That was the one they needed. He went over the wicket and he's got him. Patan's got the big wicket that could well win the match for India. What a strike late in the day. He's knocked him over as clean as a whistle. Whoa, I'm on your bike. Way she goes. A magnificent hit of the ball. Cameron White. Simon's out, gone. He's got two in a row. He's on a hat trick. Bond. Well, well. All of a sudden, Bond bouncing, no ball. Wicket, wicket. And it's seven for 286 in the final over. Got it! Hat trick, slower ball. Beautifully bowled. Well done, Shane Bond. Good comeback. Reckon's gone. And it's another wicket down. All the New Zealanders. Well done. And Bond. Not James, Shane with a hat trick. Still got hair there, 24 years of age. Humble. There's one thing that hasn't changed. <laughs> go on, say it, go on. <laughs> it's not casting a shadow there, is it though? There we are, There's, there we are, the young Bull Lorry. These are the heavies here, look at these bikes. Have a look at this bike here, Ronnie. Oh, Louis. Just keep an eye if Hazelwood uh, Collins for one. And what about the great man? <laughs> Got him! <laughs> <laughs> and that's the view of the beautiful Sydney cricket ground. And what a catch, what a ripper! This is a short reach taken, one of the best catches you will ever see. It's in the air. Horses coming around for mid-off, he's getting under it. And what a beauty! What a great catch! Jeff Lawson taking a superb outfield catch. The ball was Rodney Hogan. What a great finish for the Australian team. The ball, he's gone! Yes, beautifully bowled. That was quicker. The young man with genuine pace on a dead third day track. Picked up a vital wicket. Bowled him! Yorked him! Beautiful piece of bowling! Sheer pace! Too good, Craig McDermott! Bowled him as clean as a whistle. First the attempted bouncer down the leg side, and then the perfect Yorker, and out went the off stump. A beauty! Close! Got to be close! That one! Yes! He's got him! That's out! Very close, didn't offer a shot, and now two wickets for victory! And a hat trick for Peter Sleep, you beauty, they cry. 9.2 overs to be bowled. The crowd chanting, in comes Sleep. But short. Catch it, he cries, he's in the top of the pad. He fends them away. Can't be caught out once the ball is dead. When it's in the top of the pad, Gladstone Small, I don't think was too sure about that. Gone, he's caught in, great catch. Umpires can fair, yes, he's out. Alan Border taking a catch, and the game, a cliffhanger, a superb catch, it went to ground, the umpire looked to square leg for verification. Peter Sleep, his final delivery. <laughs> got him, he got him, 15 for Australia, they've won with one over remaining, so the runabout ends the end of a very memorable test match. Victory by 55 runs, five wickets to Peter Sleep. One of the all-time great test matches. Well, what can we say? But that's one of the most exciting finishes you'll ever see. Well, yeah, really on the rack now for Fleming. A wonderful opportunity to get two hat tricks in a test match. Gals Renard bowled his heart out yesterday for India. Now the final leg's coming up into the gully position. He's surrounded by fieldsmen. So Damien Fleming on a hat trick. He's got it! Oh, Warne's dropped it! Can you believe that? Shane Warne, who got a hat-trick at the MCG, has dropped the hat-trick catch. And it was almost regulation. It was sharp, but he normally would have caught that. Cracking shot. Good man. Got it! Oh, what a catch! What a catch! McGill, the skipper, thrust it away and carried 65 metres and still at McGill. In the air, there's a man out there, he's coming around, he's going to get close to it. Oh, what a ripper! That could turn the whole game. Adam Dale, he's got three wickets with the ball, that's one of the best catches you will ever see. Oh, that's a wreck.
that's one of the biggest hits you'll see. That's a magnificent hit. The greenies hit it up in the top of the stand. And the school house, they're loving it. That's as good as you'll see. Let's go! What a catch! Mark Waugh, that was a genuine low cut at the top edge. And he caught it as clean as a whistle. We go over the top. The men will go back inside the circle. They're right on the line. He'll probably pitch it in towards Rex Stump in the full. the Sydney Cricket Ground. What a shot under pressure. The crowd is going mad at the Sydney Cricket Ground and why not? You'll see one of the all-time great one-day innings from a young man who's fought his way back into the Australian side and a full house goes berserk. Six for 71. No one cannot believe it. What a catch. It's nicely played. Finds a gap at cover. Oh, it's no, what a tragedy. It's going to be a run out. That's oh! Gilchrist doesn't take the poor throw. What a run off. Listen to the crowd. What a start for India. Certain running out gone miss. What a good piece of bowling, 151.1, a wicked maiden, superb fast bowling, and a big breakthrough. Down quickly. It's gone for it. There it is. Not a bad time to bowl. The pressure's been on the Australian batsman. The runs have dried up. It's a 5 4 304, slowly but surely, the South Africans are clawing their way back. Oh boy. Doesn't she look gorgeous? Well, go on then, say something. He won't say anything, it's got to be a pigeon before he comments. You dig a hole, you filled up, mate. <laughs> Uh, Greg will be back shortly, he's just filling a hole at the moment. <laughs> Isn't it a great... That's a good shot, that's the third of the minute, they could catch this, he could, he can, oh, what a ripper, what a catch, he had the pencil to begin with, he went back, he knocked it up, caught it on the second grab, that could be a match winning catch. Superb, absolute cricket, it was on, and that fence was very, very close. Cruiser on strike. There it is. They go for this. will be out, surely. Ah, oh, it's out. It's going to be run out. Oh, that's it. South Africa out. Donald didn't run. I cannot believe it. Australia go into the World Cup final. Ridiculous running with two balls to go. Donald didn't go. Kluzner come. What a disappointing end for South Africa. What a match for our viewers right around the world. Kluzner not out. 31. Donald's run out. Australia into the final. This should be... A great moment for Warren if he can uh, pick up a wicket here, give him 699, and if he's fit and uh, plays in Melbourne, the opportunity to take the 700th wicket of his career in front of his own crowd. Game! It's all over! And could you ask for more? The end returns to Australia. A magnificent moment for Ricky Ponting and his magnificent 11. Oh, it's down it goes. Did it carry? You're not sure. They couldn't catch a cold in the middle of winter. They really are struggling in that department. Swift's got his hand on his knees. He moves away. There it goes. Oh. Part-time bowl. The captain makes the right change and they put it down. Ah! Bowling around his legs. Yes, that's superb bowling. Everyone getting too far across.
Cross, Vaughan claims his third wicket, and it's all happening in South Africa. They're going to be beaten today, one feels. It's all happening, completely confused. The return catch, look at the crowd, what a spell of bowling. Yes, here it is, in flight he did in, beautifully flight, it was higher. He went into half a drive, simple catch, 5 for 13 for Warren, and what a spell of bowling. This is what Test Cricket is all about. Shane Warren, that was a beautiful delivery to get it. That was been bowled for 45. And McGrath used it beautifully to knock over England then too. Gone! 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 Is it? Oh, he dropped it. What an effort. He had it. Ricky Ponting dives away and for just one brief moment it looked out. Wow. Lehman, Nixon, he's gone. Yes, he has, and it's 5 for 140. Around the wicket, Lehman smashing. There was a big nick, and the crowd roars at the MCG. This game is not over yet. He's got in. Yes, he's gone. It's 6 for 140. He takes the catch. This game is alive and kicking. Oh, that's close this time. He's getting Rodmarsh just about to throw it up. Oh, it's hit him. Hit him somewhere around about the shoulder or neck. Oh! No comment needed. He's hit it many a mile. He's six for six. It's over. A magnificent hit from Wayne Daniel. Hit the line, pitching down the wing side. And look at the jubilation in the Western Union room. And rightly so. Park for six runs and what a finish to a magnificent match. That's four. That makes it interesting. Bruce Reed. Swung right. At six. Is it? That's a big hit. It's somewhere over there. I can't see. It's gone. It's gone for six. A magnificent hit. Smash. Warren. Warren Fields. Just the single. There's the throw, the game throw, there's another throw, what a time for another throw, there's another one. Reed. There it goes, it's in the gap, it's going over towards the boundary, it's four runs and Lamb pulls up in the ridiculous victory. What a performance by Alan Lamb, he struggled for 99 deliveries. It's a position the Australians against Gower. that wouldn't he? Swaying there with a bond on the top. Oh, wonderful. There they go. Look at you go. Bee Gees. At 5 for 51, they've quietened down a little bit. And even up here, Bill. We've got a new producer and he's not going to last long, I can tell you that. <laughs>